Hi everybody, this is Mr. Park with a quick screencast on how to check for work that's been returned in Google Classroom. So in the Google Classroom workflow, this is work that a student has turned into the teacher, but the teacher has returned because the student needs to correct or finish completing the assignment. So the easiest way to check for returned work is to go to your student's Gmail account. And to get there, from Google Classroom, you can click on the waffle menu and choose Gmail. And that will open up your student's Gmail. And here we can see we have a couple of messages. This message says that the teacher, in my case, me, has returned the assignment called Hypertopic Example. So we have in the email, we see that the teacher just returned the assignment. And if you click on the link, you'll go to the assignment. But we'll do that in just a second. A lot of times when teachers return assignments, they will add a private comment on what you need to fix on the assignment. So that will be another email in your student's Gmail account. So open it up and it says, hi student, the teacher has added a private comment on HyperDoc example. And the comment is, please complete the apply section. So, oh, that's what we forgot to do. We forgot to click the reply or complete the apply section. So we'll click HyperDoc example and the link will take us to the classroom assignment where we can click our work, complete the work, and hit resubmit. So that's the easiest way to find returned work. Another way will to be is to find returned work from the Classwork tab in Google Classroom. So here we are in the Google Classroom class. We can click on Classwork and click on the assignment HyperDoc example and see right here it was returned. So that's the second way. Once again, the easiest way is to go to your student's Gmail account and look for an email from the teacher saying assignment has been returned. And sometimes look for a private comment, which will tell you what to fix on the assignment. And also you can actually check the assignment in Google Classroom. So that's it. Have a great day.